All right, guys. Um, well, if you're watching this, thank you guys very much. Uh, we finally reached 300 subscribers. It's something I'm really proud of. Uh, today we got something big on deck. Got off of work, went to go eat with my brother, and uh, took a small little 20 minute rest. And we got my uh, my first track workout of the season. Uh, looks like we'll be doing 2x100, 2x150, 2x200, 2x250s. Um, so kind of something to get the legs moving, uh, getting used to running fast, uh, sprinting again. And probably like a three, four mile uh, run before. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. I'm gonna be running with some guys, so some pretty fast guys and and men and women, both fast. And yeah, gonna get to see some of my my old friends again, some of my um, competitors. Gonna be uh, training with them. Uh, but it's gonna be really nice to be able to see them all again, to be able to get back on the track. Just the, just the the fact that I'm getting back on the track to me is something amazing, something that I honestly didn't see myself doing again um, for a while because of how unmotivated I've been, how inconsistent. But things are different now, where things are looking like they're headed towards the right direction. And progress is always better than no progress. And I'm proud of where we're at right now. I'm proud of where me, my family, my brother, my my daughter, I'm proud of where we're all at right now. Uh, not really too much to complain about. Just grateful to the man above for, for the ability and the gift that he's given me. So yeah, I'm gonna, got about a 20, 30 minute drive to the track. And I'll, I'll bring you guys with me, bring you guys along, probably try and get some footage. Um, but yeah, we'll see you guys right now. All right, guys. So I'm here with Gonzalo. I'll show you guys Gonzalo right now. I raced him, I think, one time already, and it was last year, fourth of July, uh, up and running 5K. But, you know, we're back again. Not as competitors this time, just as training partners. Same race as the great legend Kelvin Chicken uh, broke the world record in. Uh, today, right now, right now we're just doing about 20, 30 minutes before we get the hit the track. But we'll see you guys right now on the track. Let me introduce you guys to to Gonzalo. <laughs> this is Gonzalo, guys. Nice to meet you guys. Comment to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Um, Gonzalo Espinosa. I'm a marathon runner from Paso, Texas. I'm a 253 marathon runner. Right now I'm just running for fun, uh, but I'll get back to it. All right, guys, you heard him. We'll see you guys right now on the track. Yeah. Plug down. Alright, like though, a quick warm up. About a thousand minute warm up. And then we'll head on to the workout. Got a lot of fast runners here, guys. So, it's gonna be a fast workout. 100, 150, 200, 250. On deck. So, we'll see you guys right now. What's going on, man? How are you? Good, how are you doing? Pretty good, pretty good. It's a fun job. I got a good Thank you. 
We're good with this lane. All right, run at your mark. Go. Some bad cramps or muscle spasms, whatever the freak you call them. Can't even walk straight without feeling like I'm gonna collapse. I this is my first speed workout in about nine months, so I feel like complete shit. Complete cramps are again. Stand up straight, guys. I'm gonna stretch out ASAP. There you go. <coughs> I felt good. Um, overall, the workout was 1 150, 2 250. But we did two one, on 100s first, then two 150s, then two 200s. I had to stop at the end of the second 200 because about 150 meters in my muscles my calves started cramping up super bad and about like 170 180 i couldn't move them at all so i tried to just push it by pumping my knees up um like five meters before you know i was supposed to, five meters before the finish um it collapsed i couldn't move at all completely fell to the ground um i didn't script myself up too bad but fell right here and then on my side but oh, i mean it is what it is um call me a quitter or whatever but i'm not gonna push myself you know to do 250s um and then risk getting more hurt so i guess it's some it's a more smarter approach from my side uh, I think because I'd rather stop when I think is necessary because I know I push myself to the limit. I, I know I push myself. My 100s were like 12.9 and 13.1. My 150s were 17.7, 17.8. And then um, my 200s were 26.9, uh, 27.2. That 27.2 was because I fell but I, I feel because I was I think I crossed it like 150 I looked at my watch it was like 17 18 so I know I wasn't too much but it is what it is guys um, next week will be better we're going to continue training smart we're going to continue doing everything we can in our power to uh, keep improving and that's how every practice is going to be looking like alright guys so um I guess that concludes the end of uh, today's vlog. Uh, today's small video um, it was kind of like a little workout. Uh, but I hope you guys like this. <coughs> I want to keep continue bringing you guys along uh, through my practices, show you guys the ups and the downs. Um, I asked somebody if they could record their own photographer for the for the club, for this club. So I mean, they were busy uh, taking pictures on their camera and stuff. So I understand enough they couldn't get a lot of footage, but um hopefully i can uh, you know look for somebody find somebody who can you know record uh kind of help me out with videos um but i mean overall today was a good run um we're gonna continue practicing every day like i said right now we're gonna continue putting in the work uh going above and beyond to uh prove that i'm not done to continue uh proving to myself to continue um practicing hard and you know hopefully be somebody I don't want to settle for an average life I don't want to settle I don't want my daughter you know you know my daughter's gonna have all my support all my love but to do that I want to be able to be somebody for her I want to be able to motivate her to inspire her to to do good to succeed uh, and that it's okay to to you know take small rests take small break periods but to get back up on her feet to get back up on your feet and to continue pushing through is <coughs> the best
best piece of advice that I could say, I guess. But uh, we'll see you guys on the next video. This video probably isn't going to be, you know, the longest video. It's not going to be, you know, A1 footage, 100%. Um, but in a little by little, I'm also going to continue putting in the work uh, in my videos and my editing and all this stuff. But um, yeah, guys, see you guys on the next one. Thank you guys for, for watching my videos. Thank you guys for your support. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe, uh, share it with somebody, share it with uh, somebody who loves to run and, you know, help me continue growing this channel, guys. It's the best way to support me if you guys support me. Um, thank you guys. And, you know, this is for all of you guys. I appreciate all 300 of my subscribers. Uh, we got more things to come. We got a lot more videos planned. But for real now, see you guys on the next vlog. Bye. Bye. Bye.